Hi, in this video, I will show you how to firmware update the DJI Osmo Pocket 3, the DJI Mic 2 transmitter, the Pocket 3 battery handle to their versions that you see here on the screen. First, let's firmware update the Pocket 3. The best way is to go through the app, the DJI Mimo app. After you open up the app, you can select the device icon on top and let it search. And of course, turn the camera on. Once the app detected the camera, just go ahead and select connect and join. It would take a few seconds. And you'll be brought here. You just have to step off to get that yellow bar highlighted. Then just go ahead and select it. And select download at the bottom. Then mobile network. And then just wait. I'll just speed up the video here. You can also read what's new for this firmware while you wait. Once at 50%, you can select install at the bottom. Here again, you would have to wait a little more. And you can see on the camera screen, the update is in progress. I'll just speed up here once again. It says to wait about two minutes. And finally, it is done. Just wait a little bit more until you see the camera screen is back on. And there you go. Just select done at the bottom. If you're OCD like me, you would wait a little more until you see the confirmation message like the word update somewhere on the screen. There you go. Now you can check the firmware version number by dragging down the screen from the top and select settings or the hexagon nut icon. Then scroll down to device info and scroll more to see the firmware version number. And there you go, version 01.02.06.04. Now for the DJI Mic 2 transmitter, you would have to go through a computer to firmware update it. So let's do that now. What you would need is a USB-C cable to connect the transmitter to the computer. You would next have to go to the DJI mobile download site which I have the link below. Then scroll down to here. If you want to read the update guide to the mic too or the transmitter, you can select the PDF here. Let's have a look. You could read more about it right here, but I'm going to go through it for you. Back to the download tab. Here is the firmware version for the mic. Select and download the BIN file. Once downloaded, go to Downloads pane. And here you can see the BIN file. Here they want you to turn the transmitter on before connecting so that the computer can detect it. Now use the cable to connect the transmitter to the computer. On the computer, allow it. You can see here the drive. This belongs to the transmitter or the mic too. Just open it and drag the BIN file into it in the root directory. Once that's done, eject and remove the transmitter, the mic. Then you will see the light alternating between green and red, which means it's updating. Just wait a little bit until it turns blue. It would take a few seconds. I'm just going to speed up the video again. And there, it's now blue. It's done. You could now check the firmware version number also 
To do that, turn on the camera and go into settings. And at the very top, wireless mic is what you want to select. Then scroll down to see the firmware version number. And there you can see 04.02.01.13. And that's it. Lastly, the battery handle. This is very quick and easy. All you have to do is go ahead and connect the battery handle to the camera. Once connected, you would see the update in progress immediately. Therefore, just wait. The light on the battery handle is now alternating between green and red, meaning it's updating. And there, finally updated. To see the firmware version for the battery handle, go to settings, scroll down to device info once again, then select and scroll down to see it. There, battery handle firmware version 13.02.02.29. And we're done. Anyway, thank you for watching.